Now when you got Max Muncy on your team. Yeah, I knew that was coming. Let's come alive. You're alive. You're currently live. It's only 15-1. Everybody just stopped scoring. He said only 15-1. Max is up though. So could be a bomb coming here pretty soon. No, he grounded out. The in-game money line. Atlanta is plus six thousand. I'm surprised that actually even still do it, being fifteen to one. That's crazy if someone puts that that bet down. The Dodgers are minus two hundred thousand. Ridiculous, they even have lines when it gets to that. For point. that one, yeah, I wonder. There would probably be limits. I mean, no one would let them put ten million dollars on the Dodgers to win up fifteen to one. I don't think. I'd do that, and it'd be like one base runner that'd already be freaking out. <laughs> <laughs> Start pacing. Start pacing. <laughs> Ten more hitters in the tying runs on the on deck circle. Did you watch uh, Jacob's case? Uh, uh, he didn't get it today. He's breaking tomorrow. Gotcha. Houston's favorite in game four. Um, they got chickering already. Is Miguel Amaya Cubs or Dodgers? He's Cubs. First and Posh, I think he's got a rookie next year in Series 1. He had a home run tonight. I think that was the, that was the one run. lone run that they had. <laughs> Okay. I have to do the the phone daily thing again. Is it doing the same thing? Yeah, I think it's gonna become the, the norm now. It's so annoying, at least the phone was working last time. <clears throat> what was the line on that, Ryan? The Dodgers the, the are, Dodgers minus, are minus two hundred thousand to minus two hundred thousand. Hi, Dave. Yes, tonight was not the night for a Braves fan, that's for sure. All right, I'm going to get some of the big, thick top loaders. I'm going to have Frame City in here in a minute. Are you sure this are thick sleeves? They're, they're, uh, the packet's right there. Should say thick on them, I think. Yeah. We'll see. I know you had a pile of them on your desk the other day. Cause I yeah, but they were right. all mixed up, and I kind of sorted it out and got rid of them. Actually, you know what? That break right there, I found a big group of them. How many of those right here? Yeah. They're in a bag. In the very front. Box toppers. Those are tips. 
Dust Devils or Astros, right? No, it's Rays. I better double check that Logan Driscoll. All right, well, we got nine watchers. I think everyone's ready for us to start, so let's get going. Tonight's break is 2020 Tops Gold Label. This is break number one. Pick your team format. Here's the teams and the team owners for tonight's break. Good luck, everyone. David C. has the Diamondbacks. Dave F. Braves. Michael has the Orioles. Robert S. We got Robert Stelzer and Steed in here. So Stelzer's Red Sox. John Cubs. Kirk has the White Sox. Craig Reds. Uh, Whitesell has the Indians. John has the Rockies. Doug K. has the Tigers. Whitesell has the Astros. Stills are Royals, Justin Angels, Jason Dodgers, Paul Marlins, Gary B. Brewers, uh, Steed Twins, Stills are Mets, Paul has the Yankees, Aaron A's, Steed Phillies, uh, David has the Pirates, Shim has the Padres, Marine Giants, Michael Mariners, Aaron Cardinals, Chris Rays, Stills are Rangers, John Blue Jays, and Stills are Nationals. Good luck to everyone. This is our first look at gold label. We had some pretty sweet cases last year. Hopefully we get some nice stuff in this one. Get somebody a gold card. We've done a couple times last year. Lonzo, I think, was one of them. I don't, did we hit Acuna, too, Ryan? Yeah, that sounds right. Yeah. Yeah, see? Yeah. I hit one of these chase. I think it was Acuna in the second. All right, here we go. Good luck. Box number one. Blue Bob on front. Figure out where the frame card is. Yeah. Uh, there's a lot of Arizona in this minor league. Just a smidge here. Kirk T, what's going on, man? Good luck to you, sir. Just in time. Box number one. Always a big fan of the gold label design. It doesn't disappoint again this year. A sharp look to the cards. Uh, we'll announce any noteworthy parallels. They get the class one, two, and three versions, I'm sure, of the base and the parallels. Our first numbered card is a class two blue of Frank Thomas. It's number 11 of 99. This is going to be Top Load City. Take me down to Top Load City. First number card, Frank Thomas to 99 Blue. I'll announce the class threes. It's the toughest of the three. So we got a class three of Andrew McCutcheon, two Gallo. We got a uh, black. I think these are the most common of the parallels. Ken Griffey Jr. I believe that's black. I'm hard to tell in there. Brennan McKay rookie. There is a Bo Bichette rookie. Zach Gallon's a class three. Caprice. AJ Puck. There you go. That's definitely black. It's down in the corner. So Christian Yelich is a black parallel, class one. Jordan rookie. Trey Turner is a black parallel, class one. As is Lindor. 
Numbered red to 25, it is a class 3 rookie of Brendan McKay for Tampa. It's number 25 of 25. Uh, let's see, let's see. Aaron Curran, I have you for St. Louis. I have you for Oakland. What did you ask here? Okay, you guys are chatting amongst each other. I see now. So McKay to 25, class 3 red rookie. Nice card for Tampa. Snell's uh, black, I believe, class 1. These ones are kind of different to distinguish. Kind of a shaded look on the base cards. A little easier when you see them in a group, though. Pull those out. All right. First framed auto. On this here break, sandwich between two base cards. We got McGuire, that's a class one black. Auto is a giant Logan Webb. Framed base auto. SF Giants. These framed autos. Logan Webb. I do too. Tani was the other base in there. And we're off to box two. All right, off we go. Box two. Verlander's a class one black. Whitten Airfield's a class two black. Lazardo rookie. Clevenger's a class one black. We got Otani to 150 blue. That's a class one. Angels parallel. If you get a minute, I did not grab enough standards. So okay, sorry. That's not urgent, but at some point I'll we'll need them. Otani Blue to 150. Kepler is a class one black. Kyle Lewis is a class one black, I believe. Gallo class one black. Oh, that's a base card, I'm sorry. Nakata definitely is. Second number card in this box is a blue class two of Christian Yelich to 99. 79 of 99. Makes it easier to pull the black parallels out of here when you get them all in a chunk here. do that going forward, just do them at the end. So our blacks in box two, we have Mankata class one, Merrifield class two, Verlander class one, and Clevenger class one. Oops. 
second frame auto. Is numbered Detroit Jake Rogers to 75, 6 of 75. Thank you. Hopefully they have grappling sessions next year, buddy. Six of seventy-five. I'm hoping they have the national next year. I think this year's is still on. Is it really? Yeah, in December. I think. I'm not sure. I'd have to look it up. It was a couple months ago. They really don't want to. Box three. Surprised there hasn't been some trends inside memorabilia. There's less stuff getting signed these days, that's for sure. Craig says the Nationals canceled. Did it cancel? Okay. Box three. Uh, as long as it's back. Nico Horner, rookie. Chicago. That's a class three rookie. Nice card for the Cubs. Gavin Lux, a class one rookie. Cards. That trout. We got Don Mattingly, class one red for the Yankees, six of seventy-five. There's one numbered card in this box. Go through and find the black parallels here. One, two, three. Five of them in there. So the black parallels and excuse me. Box three, we had a class one Willie Mays, class two Cattell Marte, class one Robinson Cano, class three Josh Bell, and a class one Max Scherzer. One numbered card, it was Mattingly to 75. And two rookies, two top rookies, Lux and Warner. Warner was the class three. So Taylor Trammell in this card says the sod poodles. I think that's San Diego, right? Uh, I can go back and look. Yeah, our mellow sod poodles at San Diego. This okay. one's a class three, that Harper is. That one's a class one. That was a class two. So you got all three of them in that box. All right. Class one uh, black is Keston Hira. He's in front of our auto. Box three. And I had Houston. I thought we had Jordan. Abraham Coral, rookie auto. He did, uh, Jordan was the one of the few rookies that did not have a rookie auto in this. He doesn't? No, that's why Houston is a lot cheaper. They have three autos, but Jordan was not one of them. Kind of strange. Well, look at me, I'm doing my checklist research oh, that today. was the only one that jumped out at me. Abraham Toro, still rocking the mini signature. Okay. 
next. Number four. Where the Jackie Robinson cards are really cool. Yeah, I love the base cards in this product. They were nice back in when the original Golden Number card coming up here. Maybe. Oh, no numbered cards in this one. That's a bummer. That's what we got on the blacks here. Class threes in that box, we had Jackie Robinson, Freddie Freeman, Carlos Santana, that's it. The blacks were Uh, Brennan McKay, Class 1, Frank Thomas, Class 2, Kershaw, Class 1, Otani, Class 1, Posey, Class 3, and Blackman, Class 2. Cal Repkin is a Class 1 Black in front of auto number 4. It's Matt Dice, Rookie Auto Angels. Check PM. It'll always be there. It'll always have cards. And it'll always be checking PMs. I miss Chris. Well, I'd like to see a Robert Base card here. I've got through four boxes without one. It could be that tough of a card to hit. And what is it, like a 100 card checklist? 100 card set. Yep. It's all set. Three cards of each guy. Yeah, I wasn't going to say it, but he does have the fake Trout signature. Mr. Dice. Yeah, there is good autos in this. They're just mega top. Four were definitely not in that category. I killed it. I'd love to get a dual auto. Number five, let's have a blue of Cattell Marte. That is a class two blue, 98 of 99. I mean, the stuff is relatively cheap in regards to cards these days. Well, it's some good autos. That's affordable. Cards every which direction in this box for some reason. Just the one numbered card. Let's 
see what the blacks were. All right, our class threes in number five, we had Verlander. Blake Snell and Trey Turner. Looks like there are three per box. Blacks, we had a class two, Alex Bregman. Frank Thomas, class one, Chris Sale, class one, Cattell Marte, class one, and Jake DeGrom swinging it, class two. Brain Auto, number five, behind a class one black of Charlie Blackman. Willie Castro, rookie auto, Detroit Tigers. You are killing them Tigers. I don't think I'm killing much, Rhino. <laughs> kill oh, Willie Castro. Doug King's going to watch this and say, that kid knows how to pull me tigers. This was a break last year where I killed you on my half. No. I didn't have many wins, and I remember the ones I get. We might be leading up to that tonight. <laughs> definitely haven't set the bar very high. There's finally a Robert. I'll thank the heavens for that. It's a black parallel too, class one black of uh, Luis Robert. I think we're going to go every which way on this one too. We got a Zach Gallon rookie, class one red, 25 of 75 for Arizona. Same direction here first. Just the one numbered card. Oh, I can't believe they only got one Yankee in that break. And the mixer break. Yeah. You know. Crazy. Class three is in number six. We got Otani, Cal Repkin. Yohan Mankata. Fourth one in here. Just three. And the blacks in number six, we get a class one Anthony Rizzo, class one Robel Garcia, class three Don Mattingly, class one Nolan Arenado, and class two Ricky Henderson. And the Robert, of course. Class 3 Clevenger and our 6th auto is numbered to 25. It's Edgar Martinez. 6 of 25. Parallel. Edgar. That's definitely the leader of the pack. 6 of 25 on that one. Did Shim have you grade his Venus? Yes. It is in my grading stack. You've all sent a group 2. 
I haven't got to you balls yet, but I will. Oh that is Michael Nelson. Congrats, Michael. Edgar to 25. Red parallel. You'd be surprised. Well, I think we'll have a good rookie auto for somebody in this. It might be the lowest auto of the case. How many you got left? I am on number seven. Gavin Lux rookie there, class two. Nico Horner, he is a class one black rookie there. We got Lazardo to 150, numbered class one blue. Lazardo to 150 rookie parallel. Class 3 rookie of him as well. Class 3's in this one. Anthony Rendon. Daryl Strawberry. And Lizardo is one of them, too. Blacks, we had a class one of Mookie Betts, class two Pete Alonso, class one Aaron Judge, and a class two Matt Chapman. EMD is watching. He said, is this heaven? Uh, heaven starts when Ryan gets here. Yeah, that's you're when about, the trolling starts. You're about 15 minutes early. Maybe 10. All right. Framed out on number seven is behind class one black each row. The White Sox, Dylan Sees, Doug's boy. Rookie auto for the White Sox, Dylan Sees. One shot left. Uh, maybe redemption in this one. I don't feel like a heavy frame there in that box. Could be a good sign. Some interesting stuff possibly going on here. 
Jordan Alvarez and Bo Bichette rookies. This is a class three Bo Bichette, by the way. Okay, rookie. We got a nice grippy parallel to 99. That's a blue class two, 82 and 99. We got another Jordan. That's a class three Jordan rookie. We got an MLB Legends relic card. 1050 Pedro Martinez. You think it was to 50? They'd hook us up with some color on that. Pedro. 1050 for Boston. That was a class three judge. I believe that's a class three black. That's true. All right, well, we had some decent base cards in this one. Class threes we had. Christian Yelich was one of them. Jordan was one of them. And so was Bichette. That was a good box for the toughest of the three. Class three parallels. Did you get a redemption? Uh, I haven't opened the last pack just yet. I can get close though. Twenty twenty three NCAA tournament going to be Vegas for regional. Just trying to talk you into a trip. <laughs> Who is? Ryan doesn't leave his comfort of his basement. Yeah, well, I have three trips planned next year. Well, we definitely have a redemption card. It's white. My vacation's full. Bubba Shep, rookie in there. We got a black Nick Castellanos, class one, and a white redemption. Make it Robert. Congratulations, you're due to receive framed autograph card of Eugenio Suarez. I am not taking ownership of that. Eugenio. Somebody else will that in there. I'm going to need oh, some baby. focus mojo for that. Uh, Cincinnati Reds. The tiniest text of all time. <laughs> see if we can get her to autofocus, even though I think everyone <laughs> probably hey, believes me. Hey, hey, yo. There it is. Hey, Eugenio Suarez. Dang it anyway. It probably made Craig happy though, so congrats to you, Craig. You're getting Suarez up with some Chrome Mojo. And we are halfway through. Brian's warming up. I'm calling victory. You might be the league leader in negative break commentary. Who? You. I didn't say anything wrong. I said no, get robbed. I'm just saying it's going to come, come to you. <laughs> I'm saying you're the recipient. I'm telling you, I will destroy you. Well, I hope you do. On these so eight. Light it up for anybody. All right, halfway. Eight more to go. Let's leave some cards as punishment. You can actually get through that way now. I know, it's crazy. How long do you think? Currently, temporary until I have the next case I can't find. Alright. 
am I supposed to start shipping? Oh, I forgot. I got to use my phone. Yes, it's already out there for you. There's not that many. I got to use my phone, don't I? Yeah. I was wondering why you didn't have to hang up. You were using your phone. You don't have a choice. Yeah, I can use the phone, actually. If I want to be social, I could just not be social because just show good cards. And Facebook. There's no reason why you need to go downhill. It was fine the way it was. He had to change it, so now I gotta use my phone to talk to people. Okay. Okay, I think my phone's set up. Good luck, everybody. I got eight left. First one. These are very sharp cards. We just like to get a few nice autos to go with them. We had really good luck last year, so if I'm going to keep that going. I got to get hot. Super thick pack right there. Last year we had a nice duel. You can troll all you want, EMD. But tonight, I'm going to be the superstar breaker. No Henry Owens coming for me. All right, shiny base cards to start with. We got a good picture there too. Well, they made the class easier to see. Christian Yelich Blue, number 70 of 150, is the second card for me. Mike Trout, class 3. Trying to look and see what Jason pulled. I'm pulling a Trout Class 3. King Grippy Class 2. I'll make a stack of the black parallels like Jason did. Blue Parallel in the 99 of Nolan Ryan. Another nice card there. Class 3 Javi Baez. Class 3 Aquino rookie for the Reds. Alvarez class 1 rookie. Black parallels. Machado class 1, Chapman class 1, Garcia class 2, and Alonzo class 1. Black's a fairly common parallel in this stuff. Which name is that? 64 of 99, Nolan Ryan. These look pretty pretty clean this year for base cards. Past years, they had some, I don't remember what year it was, but there was a lot of white in the corners. 
I don't see that much of this year's. My first auto <clears throat> you know this is my product because they put a base card on each side so I can slow roll starting off with a little numbered card of Logan Webb 22 of 50 start off with 1 to 50 and Logan Webb eats me up Let's blame that one on Eric and move on. Nice card for San Francisco. I would have liked to have seen a little bigger name when we hit one out of 50. Oh, Henry. All right, well, let's see if I can improve on Logan Webb. To 50. That's all I got, damn it. Knocking out a parallel numbered. Yeah, Razarin is hot. He signed a decent amount, too. He's probably easier to get than most of the other rookies. He just crushed another home run. Man, he is just really high. He picked a good time for it, I guess, huh? If you're going to get hot, you might as well get hot in October. All right, pack two for me. Class one, Baez. Black parallel. Aaron Judge. Aquino rookie, Nico Horner class one rookie, Trout Black class number one, Black Parallel of uh, Sitsugo for the Rays, Mookie, Yordan class two rookie, uh, getting a lot of Trouts all of a sudden, Trout class one, Mattingly class one, Black Parallel, Ichiro Blue. 131 of 150. Glaber. Class 3, Mariana Rivera. Class 2, Bo Bichette, rookie. That one was probably a pretty tough one to predict, David. For the Cardinals. He had a nice year though. He is an older rookie. He was in the Levator trade, right? Matthew Levator. Alright, auto number two. Got a Gavin Lux rookie. And Walker Bueller Black Parallel blocking an auto of Keston Hira. It's a nice auto. 41 of 75. Black auto Keston Hira. Second auto is pretty strong for me. That's going to Gary B, who will take any Keston Hira auto I hit for him. Forty-one of seventy-five of Keston. Gavin Lux had a rookie in there too. That was a good pack. Would not be surprised if Levator ends up being a pretty solid pitcher at some point. Well, I hope the Dodgers Braves series goes at least six or seven. 
because honestly, the playoffs need a little bit of a jolt. There's no Red Sox, no Yankees, no Cardinals, no Cubs. Dodgers Braves might be the last chance to get a decent buildup going. No, I don't have too much shipping to do. What do you want to open? I'll probably open a box for you if you want. I'm still doing a um, se um, setting up a new accounting system, Eric. So I've been spending a lot of time doing that. You should see my detailed chart of accounts. You'd be impressed. Black Parallel, Ronald Acuna, Class 1. Another Trout, Class 2. I've hit several Trouts. Mattingly, Class 1. Josh Bell, Class 3. Xander, Black Parallel. Rizzo, Black Parallel. Wait, is that? Yeah, I think so. Black parallel of Kepler. Blue parallel. Class 3, number 38 of 50 of rookie Rebel Garcia. Class 3, Don Mattingly. Class 2, Mac McGuire. I can label you a bad dad. Actually, I, I'm a cruel accounting, so I label you a bad debt. All of your purchases are 20% estimated to be a bad debt, Eric. So anytime you buy and pay for anything, 20% of that goes to future EMD bad debts. Auto number three, I've had two numbered autos so far. San Francisco, Mauricio Dubon, base auto. Back to San Francisco, what's up with these Giants? Next auto is going to be Mike Trout. Class 3 Buster Posey there. All right, three opened. I got a Keston to 75 and a couple San Francisco Giants. To be completely honest, the accounting system that I'm doing right now only lets me do FIFO which is perfectly fine with me. Not yet, David. Top loaders are still kind of tough. Especially thicker top loaders. I've been looking for some thicker top loaders for Jacob for a couple of weeks, and just nobody has them. A lot of the other stuff has returned to normal. Top loaders have not yet. You can usually find them, but they're still about 15 to 25% higher than they were before. And then some of the other, and sometimes you, they're a little harder to find. Ooh, I got a red. 70 of 75, Francisco Lindor. Nice card for the Cleveland Indians. Love Lindor. <laughs> Francisco Lindor, 70 of 75. Stanton, 
Kyle Lewis, class two. Robin Yount, black parallel. Lazardo rookie for Aaron, class two. Springer black, class one. Kano black, class two. Some of these cards have a little bit of chipping on the bottom. Most of them are nice, but some of them have a little chipping on the bottom. Aquino Black Parallel, Class 1, Chipper and Griffey. Here's Kyle Lewis, rookie. He does not have chipping on him. He's pretty nice. It's a Class 2 Kyle. Uh, I actually have bought from them time to time. Jason to be, uh, they, they do have a pretty big supplies. I normally would used to get them from the BCW directly. They just are always out. I did order some top loaders from BCW last week, and their arrival time is February of 2021. But I still ordered them because it's the normal old price. It's one of those things where I just get a little bit from a lot of spots so I don't run out. Tim Anderson Class 3 is blocking a A's autograph. We got a chance for Aaron. Beat Lazardo. Sean Murphy. Sean Murphy rookie auto. Catcher for the Oakland Athletics. Yes, that's true. You should have one graded really soon. It's I'm not sure why it hasn't popped. They're probably looking for an explanation on what to tell me on it. What do we tell them? We know these are EMDs, but we didn't throw. We think we destroy all of them. We've never given this many PSA fours on brand new cards before. Well, Murphy was the last one. Had a couple Giants. Keston. Let's see what's in this one. That 20 day you're waiting on, I have 20 to 25 cards in there that I really want back also. So you're not the only one. That one's got to be soon. It's been a while since we sent that one in. Kyle Lewis, rookie. Ken Griffey Jr., class 3. AJ Puck class two, Lazardo class one, Whitman or Whit Merrifield class one black parallel and a blue, Max Scherzer, ninety of one fifty, for Max. Are you kicking my butt? Uh, that doesn't sound very convincing. I'm probably forget. beating you, but I need some more cards. Tatis class two. Brennan McKay, rookie. Cody Bellinger, black parallel. Walker Bueller, black parallel, class three. I think that's a little tougher. Am I going to get a Robert? I have not got a Robert yet. Sitsugo, class one, black parallel. Arenado, class two. How many Roberts you get? We're due for a couple Roberts. All right, I'm giving Griffey a top loader because he's awesome and it was a class three. And Kyle Lewis is getting a top loader.
That's a bonus 10 cent top loader for those guys. Yeah, Willie Mays base card. And George Springer in front of an autograph for Texas. That is Nick Solak. He's the only auto for Texas. Not a, too bad of a rookie there. Not as big a name as we want, but... And then Murphy got a shot to be decent, I think, right? Oh, man. How about a vet auto? Just to impress a little bit. Pretty nice card of Willie Mays. I got three chances left. And last year I hit a dual auto and a gold and a, some good base. I remember it because I was like thinking I was like five good autos in a row. I'm going to have to go back tonight and watch that video. Relive my last good break. I think it was because Eric wasn't in the room. I think he might be the problem. Randy hit a big home run tonight. Raz Arena on fire. Hey, I got a Luis Robert rookie. Class one. We'll take it. <laughs> she, if she doesn't know why you're watching that by now, then she doesn't know you very well. Are you watching card breaks again? No, he's watching Coastal Carolina versus Louisiana. Obviously, his wife doesn't realize he's a degenerate gambler yet. Class 1, Black Parallel, Bryce Harper. Ooh, Javi Baez, red, 49 of 50, Class 2. Gotta have some action. 49 of 50 for Javi. I like those red parallels. Those are sharp. Kyle Lewis again. That's a class three. I'm hitting Lewis best of all the rookies. Buster Posey black parallel. Jackie Robinson. Ricky Henderson. Tony Gwynn. Juan Soto class three. And Vladimir Guerrero. Okay. Soto class three and Kyle Lewis rookie get top loaders. All right, I got three left. This is one of them. It's now or never, Ryan. Show me some sort of duel. No, no duel. That is the Miami Marlins only auto. Jordan Yamamoto. Jordan Yamamoto. Miami hit a card. Two left. get me a sandwich from Buffalo Wild Wings after this break. They have a, a wrap that I got the other day and it was so good. I'm telling you. You're the king of scout food. A really good wrap.
And we had one double, Robert. Well, it was a numbered one and a regular one. It was a double, Logan Webb. All right, base cards in box 15. I got class three chipper, blue parallel of Joey Gallo, 49 of 50. Juan Soto, class one. Kyle Lewis again, class one. I think I've hit five Lewis rookies. Class three, Aloy, and a class two of Robert. Better box here for rookies luck. Lazardo, class one. Mike Schmidt, Black Torres, Ricky Henderson. Red parallel for Chipper Jones, 19 of 75. Nice card of Chipper. <laughs> you have a lot of them, Chris. Chris, I drafted him in fantasy football or baseball this year. And he got cut midway through. I mean, he could be fine at some point, but it wasn't this year. What are you talking about? Jordan Yamamoto. He was decent last year, and this year he did not have it. I got him cheap, too. He was like three or four bucks. I'm like, that's a pretty good value for a guy in Miami that could be okay. And he didn't even make the original rotation. Black parallel of Santana and a black parallel of Altuve class two. Auto time. Got a Cunha base card on one side, Francisco Lindor on the other. Come on, Ryan. Oh, man. Seattle rookie, Justin Dunn. I saw Seattle. For some reason, I had some sort of fantasy that it was going to be Kyle Lewis. In reality, slapped me back in. This stuff is not enduring ourselves to a second break. Justin Dunn. We got one more chance for a highlight. I think Gary B might be the only person I make happy. Last box. I believe I can't at least hit Razarina. Isn't he supposed to be one of these guys that signed a bunch? <laughs> it's true, Matthew. It's true. All right, I'll do the recap after this. All right, Zach Gallon, rookie, is the first card. Fernando Tatis, class one, black parallel, and Joey Votto to 150. 23 of 150 for Joey Votto. Nolan Ryan, base card. Glaber, class two. Strauss, no, well, that's not Black Parallel. AJ Puck, Black Parallel, Class 1. Red Parallel for the Reds, 22 of 50, Sunny Gray. Ichiro, Class 3. Each row class two, right next to it, Ricky Henderson, black parallel of Tanaka. Same thing, Chris Sale, class two, class one, rookie of Luis Robert. I think if Jacob's going to have a better case tomorrow. He's 
going to Jackie Robinson, Freddie Freeman, Mookie Betts, Class 3, Nico Horner, Rookie, Class 2. Nice Mookie in there. And a Nico Rookie. I think that was the first Nico Rookie I hit in those eight. My last auto. We're going to end this with some fun. Or am I just going to whimper through a recap? So we got Glaber on one side, Rizzo on the other, and the auto. LA Dodgers pitcher, Dustin May. A little bit better. I had a couple middle of the road rookies, a couple pretty rough rookies. Keston. Not the best eight for me, but Dustin has some fans. L.A. Dodgers, Dustin May. All right. Let me recap this, baby. If anybody wants a box of something later on, I'll probably go back on after I eat a meal. And if you don't want something that takes forever to open, I'll let you jump in front of the line in front of Eric. What's he opening? Probably something that will take me five years to open. Strong possibility. All of a sudden, he used to be one where he opened like $200 boxes that had one card, and now he turned into the bulk. We need a lot of Kyle Lewis rookies. Thanks, everybody, for taking off. <laughs> Sorry, Matthew. Thanks everyone for taking off. <laughs> <laughs> for, did I say take? I said if you're taking off. Sorry, I'm oh taking my off. God, you took off a long time. Ago. <laughs> yes, this break whipped me into a. I'm on a mini break tilt. Hoping you had Robert when you had that redemption. I see a redemption. I imagine he has these redemptions and everything, it seems. Yeah. You're going to have to have one hell of a signing with them. Springer in a home run. You know what? I have a new box list done, Gary. I'll post it before I go live. I forgot I was going to post it earlier. I have some football. Everything in football this year is like a couple hundred bucks, though. Is this Suarez a base? Yeah. Man, Edgar's my favorite auto of the break. Okay, recapping time. This was our first gold label break, 16 boxes. Blue parallels to 99, Yelich, 150, Votto. Otani, 150, Thomas, 99, Cattell Marte, 99. Griffey, 99, Lazardo 150, Ichiro, 1 to 150. Yelich to 150, um, Nolan Ryan to 99, Robel Garcia to 50. Max Scherzer to 150, and another 1 to 50. That one was Joey Gallo. We also had some red parallels. Let's see. We hit the man Don Mattingly in there. So to 75 red, we had Chipper Jones, Zach Allen, rookie. Nice card for Arizona. And Don Mattingly to 75. To 50, Sonny Gray. To 50, Baez. And number 25 to 25, rookie red of Brendan McKay. Nice card there for Tampa. Jason hit the only relic. MLB Legends of Pedro Martinez. 
Pedro's number 10 of 50. Nice card for the Red Sox. Base autos. We had one redemption. Eugenio Suarez. All right on top. Other base autos. Justin May, Justin Dunn, Jordan Yamamoto, Nick Solak, Sean Murphy, Mauricio Dubon. More base autos. Dylan Cease, Willie Castro, Matt Theis, Abraham Toro, Logan Webb. Oh, I missed one red parallel. I'm sorry. We hit to 75. Francisco Lindor, too. It was in the wrong stack. Jason and I hit four numbered autographs. Two black autographs to 75. Keston Hira and Jake Rogers. A blue 22 of 50. Logan Webb. And a red Edgar Martinez. Six of 25. And that's it. Sorry for those that did not hit well. It was not the most content fill break we've had, for sure. I am going to post my box list tonight. If anybody wants a box shipped with their breaks or something, let me know. I'll try to give you a deal. Or if they want something open tonight, I'll have a little bit of time, I think, to open. Probably start about 10, 10, 15 Central Time. Have a good night. Thanks, Robert.